All right, well, it's time for some train ranking um, of the British kind. Um, now, as I do not know most of these trains or their class names, I'm going to be basing them off of looks. And by the few that I know, I'll be basing them off of if I like them or not. <laughs> um, so, to start off with, we have the Class 08 Shunter. Now, these things were absolute workhorses, so, uh, they're just god tier. We love them. Um, not sure what that is. It's like, it's like a pacer, but it's not. I know, it looks kind of like a pacer, but it kind of doesn't. Um, might be just a modified pacer, I don't know. It's... Uh, I don't mind the paces, I know they're kind of bad, so it goes in good territory. Um, so all of these kind of look the same, so they all get the same ranking really. Um, don't look too bad, they also go in good. So we're just going to bonk, badonk, and badonk. Now as for... This, the, the, this, <laughs> fucking, whatever the hell that accent was, um, the 158s, they're decent, don't mind them, uh, I guess they go great tier because they're pretty good for what they are, uh, this train, uh, the 159s, I just realised I can tell what class they are by their numbers, um, mm, it looks, it looks okay, it's a neutral. Um, this train, the 165s, are pretty goofy looking, but they're also pretty okay, so that's in neutral territory. Um, as for this, this looks like a mix between a pacer and the one I just did, so that's, that also gets neutral territory. Now this just reminds me of SR, these, actually, you know, these three here just remind me of SRC. Um, and this reminds me of British Rail, the game on Roblox, it's, oh, what is that, um, so yeah, they're not the greatest, I know I'm just gonna keep, I don't wanna be harsh, but that one looks weird as hell, this one looks okay, but that's going in bad, because it's top headlights a bit small, and the blue one's gonna go in neutral. Um, that one there, the one from British Rail, it's just gonna go in bad, the headlights look weird. The headlights look really weird. Um, now as for whatever these things are, this one just looks like it ran into a brick wall, considering the front of it's that flat. Um, that's, that's just really bad territory right there. Um, so there's this, it looks like it's trying to imitate one of those high speed trains, like one of the, yeah, like one of the freaking Eurostars, where it's a Eurostar ripoff, or like one of the Azumas, or whatever the hell you call them. Uh, let me find them, one of these ones. Um, so it's, yeah, it just gets bad, a really bad territory. Um, this train looks weirdly feminine. Not liking that too much, but bad to actually no, that's a neutral. It's not it's not the worst looking thing I've ever seen. I wouldn't this looks boxy, so it goes in bad. Okay, well you have the Bakerloo Lion trains. Um I believe it's Bakerloo Lion by my trains and world experience. Um and eh, pretty good looking. As for the rest of them yeah, they kind of get the worst. They kind of they're like cars. They get uglier the more modern they get. Um, this one still holds some of the resemblance to the original one, so I'm gonna bring that up into good. Um, that one has a flat front. It's it's a neutral. This one's a neutral too, and this last one just looks hella goofy, so it's gonna go in bad section. It's like a pyramid here. Um. Whatever that is, no idea what that is. It's, it looks like a British Rail era diesel, which we all know 
usually isn't a good thing, but because it gives me Boko vibes, and I like Boko. Boko's a nice character, so he gets to go in good. Um, okay, these things, I'm pretty sure these are what weren't, they tried replacing the HSTs with, so not a big fan of those, but neutral territory. That one looks a bit goofy, so that goes in bad. What the hell is with the headlights on that? Why are they on the side? What the hell is that? That is disgraceful in my opinion, so really bad. Um, I like. I really like those big number boards. Really like those. Um, so that's a good territory. These are from uh, GCR, that game. I remember I saw them in there. They were pretty good. I liked them. Didn't mind driving them. Neutral territory, but... I think that's good territory right there. As for these, they look kind of goofy. Really goofy, actually. But neutral. As for this, it looks like it ran into a brick wall. Um, same with some of the other ones. Bad. Mm, looks a bit goofy, so bad. Yeah. You get my point. You get the point. As for the mail train... I actually quite like those. Um, they're pretty good, so great territory right there. Um, the these, I think that yeah, those, those are diesels, right? I like the, I like that. Good, good territory. Goes up with Boko. Um, whatever that is again. Headlights look weird. British trains just have weird headlights. I feel. I don't like the headlights, but that's just get it's gonna go bad. It's not terrible. That's neutral. I don't really mind this one too much. SRC vibes here. Oh, it just creates a new row for me, doesn't it? Um, don't know what's wrong with that train. Oh, that one looks weirder. Um, that's just gonna go into really bad territory. That one. Um, uh, that one, it, it can just go into bad, I'm not that harsh. Uh, the Eurostars, um, I'm used to this one, I like this one, I like this, but I like this better, um, so that's just gonna go in neutral and we're gonna Grab the Eurostar and go up into good. Oh, we still have a lot to do. Damn, there's lots of trains on this list. Um, hey, well, they're all mostly the same. Oh, the 377s, the Electrostars. Yeah, I like those. I like those. My train sim mode 2 experience on the computer, which can barely load up. Uh, that is. That is great territory right there. It's not superior, but it's great. Um, okay, this just reminds me of the metro trains we have in Sydney. You know, those shitty driverless trains are kind of goofy. Um, really bad. I just don't like the way they look. Um, and I'm not even going in order right now because I'm weird. Um, so. The 375s are pretty similar. I think they also get to go up into really good territory. I'm going to see if I can bring this out a bit more so I can just see better. Uh, oh, where'd it go? There it is. Bonk. Okay, that one looks really goofy. Bonk. Mmm, bad. It's a pass on my end. Uh, that's so uh, good, that one. Okay, are these the Deltics? I think they're the Deltics. I like the Deltics. Uh, so, as we all know, they are clearly superior locomotives. Um, okay, all these Electro style lookalikes. Pretty sure they all are kind of just the same thing. Um, Good. It's good. Okay. So you have 
this, which gives me those gives me Virgin Pendolino vibes. Um, maybe that is the Pendolinos. I'm not sure. Been been a long time. Maybe they rebranded. Uh, new. Like, where'd I put it? I lost it. I lost it. I can't see it. There it is. You know, I liked them when I was young. So good territory. These are mid neutral. This is practically an electric. Is that the electric version? No, that's the the electric version. Is these ones down here? But it's like still like the the box design isn't the best thing in the world, but but they're good. They're good. Okay, the one we've all been waiting for the class forty three HST. Um. Now they're splendid, splendid things they are. Um, we're gonna just, you know, move them up into superior. But they're they are also um, the basis for the XPT. And if you're not sure what that is, um, the NSW XPT. If my Google will load, um, basically there are express passenger trains. Very grainy images, I know. Um, they're pretty decent things. I think I'm just going to retire them soon, sadly. Um, but, you know. Um, kind of into the front of that one. Um, but it looks a bit goofy, but it, it's mid. Neutral. Mm, these two are basically the same thing. Um... They look kind of goofy, bad territory. That one gives me Russian vibes for some reason, so does this one. This one looks angry. Um, so those are probably in there. Uh, this one's angry, so it's that. Uh, goofy box head. Um, is that what, 47? They're pretty good looking anyway. Uh, good territory. Okay. Um, because that one's a bit flat on the front there, and I'm not. Wait, no, the ones up there, where were they? Well, that's not a Delta, is it? That's the Delta. You know, those are the Delta. What, what the hell is. What the hell is that? And you know, they both get the same. I'm just gonna move this one. Up while I have it because same kind of look to them. Uh, this is goofy looking. This one, uh, computer lag. Um, not a hundred percent sure what those two are, but they're pretty neutral. I don't feel much for them, but they're not bad. Is that the? No, those are 66s. They look pretty much the look very similar. The, now, the 66s are by far the goat of freight railroading in the UK. So they go into great territory. Um, not sure how long we've been dragging on here. Um, the recording software does not have a time on it. I goddamn hope it's actually recording the voice like it's meant to be. Otherwise, uh, it'll be, you know, it'll be just be awkward. I've been sitting here at a table talking for the last 15 damn minutes. Um, the modern freight engines, especially this one, I do not like. They look really, really, really weird. That goes worse. I hate that. What's with the... What's with the... It's like, it's like the curves, but they're not curves, they're very straight, sharp, I don't like that. That kind of gets there. And that's, uh, that's the mid. Um, uh, any old British Rail train is decent, so it gets a neutral, I guess. As long as it wasn't, you know, complete, I don't shit. Um... Yeah, we've got like the <laughs> the G and W livery going on there. Um, 
Oh no, not more London Underground trains. Um, help me. Um, that one, I don't mind that. Goes in good. Looks decent. I like the way it goes down like that. Looks very, very nice. Very nice. Um, whatever the hell that's meant to be, uh, don't enjoy the look of that. Or that. Uh, what's with the front? Why is it so boxy like that? Like, it's like the British tried their hands at, like, like an NR class. Google. The British tried their hands at one of these and failed miserably. Um. It's okay. I don't mind it. Uh, that goes in good. Okay, we're down to one line of trains. Um, now, you, it's been a pretty average tier list. Um, it's kind of a bunch of stuff for everything. Superior is kind of scarce, but you know how it is. Um, so that's kind of goofy looking, but... You know, I just say goofy looking a lot, because a lot of them are. Like, your British people used to design good trains, beautiful trains, like the... Used to have, like, you know, the fucking... What do you call them? Um, trying to think of those fancy LMS ones. They weren't the... No, they weren't the princess class, no. That's not what they were. Um... Uh, well, you had the black, the LMS had the black fives, they're pretty good. Um, the LNER had some pretty good engines too. Uh, the 9Fs were chonky, chonky boys. I bet they could pull a, pull a lot, I'm not 100% sure on their exact pulling power, but, you know, that goes in good. Uh, I've just been mindlessly stacking them while I've been ranting on, uh... A goofy looking train, like someone just slapped it in the face. Uh, now, these express ones, uh, I'm gonna put them in bad because they kind of bring these in to try and replace the HSTs. And anyone that tries to replace the HSTs is bad. Naughty, naughty, naughty. Sound it sucks. Uh, that's a Freightliner, that's a electric ones, and that's presumably another freight one. The headlights on that one look really goofy. The horn just sticking out like a, it's a unicorn, my guy. Um, that one's neutral. That one, since it's very similar to this, gets good territory. Uh, that's maybe even, maybe even great territory, I feel. Probably give it great territory. Um, and as for this, what is with that? Why is there two destination boards and a number board? And why are the windows so big? And what am I looking at? What the hell am I looking at? Um, yeah, I don't like that. I just, I just hate that. Okay, well, that's pretty much it in a nutshell for today, um, British trains, excluding the steam engines, I don't know if a steam engine tier list actually exists, um, I searched one up but I didn't get much results, um, I might create one and actually do one myself sooner or later, but as for now, that's not my biggest priority, um, so we're just gonna wrap this up here. We got the class 08s and the Delta looking thing and the Deltas and the class 43 in Superior was they are clearly the best. Um and these goofy things in worst of the worst because look at them. Um and that's all folks. Good night. <laughs>